Hey everybody, Mike here at Game From Scratch. Today we're going to be checking out Unity's recently released free particle pack. And this one is pretty awesome, actually. It's a collection of particle systems that you can use, drop into your game. Uh, they're all prefabs, although it does come as a sample project, so you might have to do a little bit of work and hoop jumping to actually get it to work uh, in your project. But without further ado, let's jump right in. It's a pretty comprehensive pack. There are a ton of different particle systems in here. And frankly, particle systems are one of those things that really make high fidelity graphics games really shine these days. A particle system is pretty straightforward. Basically, it is a collection of particles. A particle themselves can be a point sprite, a texture, etc. And you use all these particles together to create complicated systems. Things like fire effects, smoke, you name it, water. And we're going to see a whole bunch of them in action. And it's one of those things I've actually always kind of struggled at creating particle systems that look good. So it's pretty awesome for someone else to do the work for me. Now, obviously, it is completely free. Uh, it's a Available in the asset store. I will do toss this link down below. Uh, you can also find it, open up Unity, open up the asset store browser and search for Unity Particle Pack and you will find it as well as an older version of this same thing. Uh, it's 140 megabytes in size and it requires Unity 2018.2.5 or higher. At least that's the supported version. It might work on an older version. I am not sure. Now do keep in mind, like all Unity projects, this one will basically open up a new project, import it in, it will overwrite your project. So uh, do be aware of that. Open it up in its own project and pull what you need out of it accordingly. So again, we'll toss this link down below, but without further ado, let's jump right in and take a look at this new particle systems. So you see, it's they've set up, they've kind of taken the Unity approach, what I like. They've kind of created this tutorial-like sample gallery level of all the various different particle systems available in the pack. And you'll see over here, the particle systems are in the effects and examples folder broken down into the type of effect being created. So say for example, water effect, Come in here, there's prefabs available for a big splash. Uh, you've got the textures required to make those particles and so on and so forth. This goes under, I don't actually know if Unity license requires me to work, it requires it to work in uh, Unity only. I think it does. So I don't think you can use these particles or textures outside in an Unreal Engine uh, project, for example, but don't quote me on that. Ask your lawyer instead, or at least read the license. Uh, but I think the standard Unity Store asset license uh, kind of does prevent that kind of um, usage. So do be aware of that. And now let's actually go ahead and look at these particles in action. And they've done a good job of these. So let's fire up the game. There you go. So here is our example level. See, we got a flamethrower over here. We've got uh, explosions going on, uh, an energy explosion. And so any of them that you're interested in, come up to it and press the space bar, and it will actually give you a description of what and how to use the particle system. So over there, and then over here, we've got the flamethrower, flame stream. We've got wildfires going on. we got a little bit of carnage coming in from the other particle system behind us. But you can see basically every kind of flame system you'd want to create there is one option available for you. Over here, we've got a rather violent explosion going on. Uh, smaller explosion, smallest explosion. Uh, to our right in the gallery, we have eh, fireflies, candles. This isn't the most impressive stuff in the pack, but uh, that's kind of cool. Heat distortions, particle systems. Uh, we have a dissolving effect and a teleporting effect. And let's continue our tour. On the right, you will find, and yeah, here's the weakest part, my humble opinion. Their water effects don't look the greatest. But you can see, oh, 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 I went through the world. All right, let's try and get back. Right, there we go. So you got splashing, and you got like a spray. They're not really hugely impressive on those ones. You do have some cool vapor and steam effects going on, though. And up here, you have pretty much a rocket launch with some smoke. And dedicated its own wing, and we'll reverse back and go the other way. So I think if I go straight through, that's our flame. The hall the way to the left was the unimpressive. Um, this is a mixed bag. Those steam contours look really good. The water, yeah, it could use a little bit of work, but still pretty solid. Uh, here we have muzzle flash, group spraying, uh, peeing. Over here, we've got ice lance. It's actually kind of cool. So it's sort of like how you could implement an ice-based weapon effect. Over here, we have a Earth Shatter. Man, look up the description on that. Earth Shatter is an example of multiple park systems working together to make a magical effect. And, you know, that's actually basically exactly what you're seeing there, a magic uh, kind of system going on. Here we see sand impacts on a system. Here we see stone impacting. Here we see wood impacts. Here we see metal impacts. And 
here we see flesh ugh, impacts. So you've got most of the systems I could think that you would want to work with are available in this suite. So it's a pretty impressive pack of things. And especially their, their fire and explosions look really good. And yeah, it's all the assets you need. It's a number of prefabs. Um, you've got some information on each one and how they go about working. And that's about the extent of it. It's, it's a cool pack. It's definitely one of those things that every Unity developer should have in their arsenal, especially if number one, you like the free price tag, which I do. And number two, you're not particularly great at creating your own particle systems, uh, which I'm not. So uh, yeah, that is the new particle pack from Unity available for free download on the asset store from Unity themselves. Again, you'll need to have a pretty newish, if not the most new version of Unity 2.0.5 or newer in order to use these effects. But yeah, pretty impressive. Good looking stuff and uh, good work releasing. I'm just amazed at just how much free stuff we're getting out from game engine companies. Um, you know, again, part of the downside is you do have a little bit of the asset flip syndrome going on. So you're going to start seeing these probably in more and more asset flip games as time goes on. But it still just gives you a good basis for creating your own derived work. So good job on releasing that Unity. And let me know what you think in the comments down below. All right. I'll talk to you all later. Goodbye.